Hello, welcome to New On View at the Detroit Institute of Arts. I'm Heather Ecker, and we're in the New Gallery of Ancient Middle Eastern Art. We're looking at our small display of Sasanian objects. Uh, the Sasanians were a, a dynasty that ruled Iran from the early third century till the middle of the seventh century. The Sasanians were lucky enough to be sitting on some of the largest silver mines in the world, so some of the greatest objects that have survived from this period are made of silver. And these were objects made either for the royal court uh, or for the elites in society. If I can draw your attention to the small bowl at center, uh, the bowl is actually made of silver. It's covered with gold, uh, gold actually that's been mixed with mercury. And we see at center a ram who has a fluttering scarf in the background. The fluttering scarf is a, a sign of the uh, royal radiance, the royal qualities of the king. So in a sense, even though the ram is associated with the Sasanian or rather Zoroastrian divinity, Bahman, it also represents the king. This was probably a cup uh, used for drinking wine. You can see other animals encircling the, uh, the ram, for example, a boar uh, or a hare. And these are animals of the hunt, another aspect of royal, um, of royal regalia of the Sasanian kings. Um, in order to bring your attention to the aspects of royalty, we have uh, several uh, coins on display, all bearing the likeness of the Sasanian king. And as you can see, there's a particular kind of view uh, that the uh, Sasanians use in order to portray a royal status. Uh, the king is almost always crowned, uh, sometimes with small wings at the top of his crown. Uh, he's bearded, and he has a sort of uh, ball of curled hair um, in the background. Most of the coins, as you can see, are silver. These are called drahim, and these were the, the beginning of the medieval um, Islamic uh, silver coinage called dirham, uh, which may be more familiar to some people. On the left here is a glass cup, uh, which is wheel cut on a, on a spinning wheel, actually probably rotated by the craftsman's feet um, in a sort of faceted pattern. And this is the typical uh, sort of style in which Iranian glass was created um, at this time. We also have a, an interesting spoon. We sort of refer to this case as the dish ran away with a spoon. This kind of spoon was produced in the Eastern Roman Empire, uh, so in Syria, but also apparently um, in Iran. And particularly because it's made out of silver, uh, one of the most um, precious and predominant materials of the Sasanian period. Uh, it's probably from the sort of uh, western part of the Sasanian Empire. So anyway, we look forward to seeing you down at the gallery and come and, come and see the Sasanian collection.